all that shit trash, whatever, that's cool, my nigga, if that's how you feel. That's not gonna hurt my feelings, man. That ain't gonna deter me from doing nothing. Because regardless of what everybody may think, I'm happy about it. That's what's wrong with you motherfuckers trying to impress everybody. I'm doing this, I gotta get some likes. I ain't doing nothing for likes. I'm doing this because my legacy, when it's all said and done, I at least want my group the one that I strive for. I'm 44 now. I've been rapping since I was eight, nine years old, nigga. And yes, I do want to go down in history because I done put my whole life into it. I didn't choose. I said everything I meant to say. Niggas, I said everything I meant to say. Niggas tell me, oh, that shit trash, whatever. That's cool, my nigga, if that's how you feel. That's not going to hurt my feelings, man. That ain't going to deter me from doing nothing. Because regardless of what everybody may think, I'm happy about it. That's what's wrong with you motherfuckers trying to impress everybody. I'm doing this, I got to get some likes. I ain't doing nothing for likes. I'm doing this because my legacy, when it's all said and done, I at least want my group the one that I strive for. I'm 44 now. I've been rapping since I was 8, 9 years old, nigga. And yes, I do want to go down in history because I done put my whole life into it. I didn't choose no other. Music saved me. What was I just at, Steve? Help me stay on track, man. Yeah, oh yeah, I was talking about, I'm just talking, yeah, y'all stay with me, pay attention, man. Because I, I, y'all also, my children and, and people that look up to me is watching my moves. That's why I wanted to handle this shit with all the diplomacy I possibly could. And let niggas know where I'm come from, because I'm tired of being bombarded and bum rushed with these comments. And niggas don't know where I'm coming from. So, you have the right... You're entitled to say if you don't like what I do. That's cool. All right? But when you when you think it's going to affect me to the point where you like, oh, you ain't. I, I looked at, I read the comments and all that. Most of the times I looked, motherfuckers didn't even really listen to it. And regardless of how you feel, I feel good about it. That shit dope as fuck, nigga. We can debate that. To me... You want to comment on a production. You want to comment on this. I heard a beat. I like the motherfucker. It gave me a vibe. I jumped straight on it. It was in my inbox. I called the producer. Hey, man, can you think I can use this beat, Blasey Skippy? He obliged it. He gave me the beat. He showed me love. All that. Thank you for producing that beat, man. ETN. Capo. E Capo. Yeah, so... Regardless, I said what I needed to say. So what you what you do don't what you how you feel don't affect me. What you eat don't make me shit. So I go about my life like that. Like okay, I'm gonna do how I feel long as I'm not doing no harm. Now by 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 all means, I ain't perfect. Nobody is perfect. I got my own problems. Motherfuckers can't wait to see me on the thing so they can take some money from me but it's all good because that's what this shit made of scavengers crabs in the buckets that mentality the disrespectful shit niggas don't think it's you should draw the line nowhere. well i think it should be rules rules to the game learn how to appreciate this shit we came from nothing to something Talk it out like me. Look at Meek Mill and Drake. Them niggas work their situation out. You know what I'm saying? And look, and I was going to come to Meek Mill because he made a point so goddamn valid that I agreed with him on when he went, when uh, 21 Savage just, you know, they everybody jumped on him about saying something about the, uh, the Jews. You know what I mean? Granted, he didn't put the thought into the whole, the, like the Holocaust and things that they really relate to. You know what I'm saying? Like the, 
They went through a lot, so you got to be mindful of what you say. But it was a compliment. And I like the way Meek Mill went on and said that, like, he like, fuck this money challenge and all this type of shit, like all this materialistic challenge. Let's have a business challenge. Let's have a, that's hot, you know what I'm saying? Let's have, he was on some real powerful king stuff, like, Let's challenge, see, let's see who got their businesses set up right. How can we, what are we leaving behind to change the world? Like, that's the mentality that I'm at these days. So I agree. I wasn't even mad at, uh, like, I, I still agree, even though I don't agree with how the nigga played his hand. I think I agree with what Meek Me- Me- Mill said and the point that he brought out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm looking at Keith Sweat. I'm looking at Master P. I'm looking at all these things niggas going through, and it's just totally out of hand, man. Totally, 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 all the way across the board is something in this atmosphere to where people think that they got the right to do just any motherfucking thing they want to do and can get away with it. No, youngster. No, it ain't like that, man. I'm here to tell you, it ain't fucking like that.